hi guys welcome back to my channel so today we have an exciting island tour this island is called willow bell and this island is described as a medieval winter themed island so i'm so excited to tour this island with you guys i cannot wait um let's take a look at the map and here is the map so here's willow bell and it looks like there are two people on this island and here are all of their villagers so they have a lot of deer related villagers here they have Bo, fauna diana um really really cool and i also love this design that they have to the left um that should be really really interesting the little um striped uh pathways that they have there so I'm very excited guys. I love medieval inspired European style inspired islands and the fact that this is in the winter time is incredible. So let's go ahead and get started. And so as you can tell this island is set at night which I think is a really nice twist. And this is so cute. This is really cute. Um, and this path looks amazing in the snow, if if I may say so. Very, very cool. I love the paintings that they have there. And here is the Able Sister shop. And let's quickly take a look at the port and how the how it would look when you get off of the airport. Oh my gosh, this is insane. This is absolutely insane. Look at that. Gorgeous. And here's what you see. Ooh. We have a resident here. Moshi Moshi. That's cute. I think. If they meant to say it in Japanese, it just means like, hello, I guess. When you say hello on the phone, that's how you kind of answer phones in Japanese. You say moshi moshi. Um, so that's kind of cute. I like that. If that's what it what they meant to say. <laughs> um, dress ups. Ooh, nice. Royal crown, dreamy dress. You know, I gotta look the part when I'm touring these, uh, these islands. Ooh, Elsa-inspired dress. Love it. Dreamy sweater. Interesting. What is that? Oh, that's cute. That's so cute. Um, I think I'll just wear that. Actually, you know what? I think I'll just wear what I wore. And... Okay, so we are good to go. And the shore, I love how they decorated, the, decorated their shore with the mermaid furniture. It's absolutely incredible. Very pretty. And here's the campsite. Wow. So it's leading you into the campsite off the shore. So this is what you get. A huge, huge bonfire to the left. And I love the waterfall, actually. 
amazing and a little bonfire to the right with some coffee cups over here and a little picnic basket very cozy and such a good view of the waterfalls the terraforming is incredible incredible I like that little gnome. What? Whoa, guys, this is crazy. Oh my gosh. Honestly, come here for the flowers too, though. <laughs> Whoa. If this isn't a view, I don't know what is. Look at this. It's insane. This is so cool. I, I bet it looks amazing during the day as well. I'm so impressed. Oh my gosh. Incredible. I love it. And the shore. Incredible. Okay, so it looks like there is a residence house here. So let's take a look. I love this song. I will always love this song. But I love this. Such a cute and cozy room. Wow. So pretty. I love all the Zodiac furniture that they have here and the statues. Gorgeous. Love it. Love it. Okay. I did not know it did that, but I love it. So cute. So amazing. I love it so much. Ooh, kind of spooky vibes in here, but very interesting. I love the woodland, um, I believe seasonal flooring. Ooh, very cozy. I love the wallpaper. I like the kind of tapestry type of wallpaper here. Very pretty. Very cozy with the fireplace as well. Ooh. I thought this was a fireplace for a minute, um, but very cute. I love it. Very regal. Very, very cool. I love it. Okay, so that was the home. I also love the snowflake door decoration that they put up. Um, I think that's very, very cute. And I just love the surrounding area of this home love the surrounding area of this home absolutely gorgeous this is also a very very cute area to sit as well and let's look at the second let's look at this second residence home Ooh, very spooky i can barely see <laughs> i can barely see in here um it might be a work in progress. Okay, so that was the home. And let's look around the island some more. Ooh, so pretty. Such a pretty view. I love the fruit orchard that they have to the left and the right. And then right in the middle is the bridge and the moon. Absolutely gorgeous. 
Very cool. And this cute little picnic area over here. Very, very pretty. Absolutely gorgeous. I love the kind of wooden pathway here. And here's an Xfinity again. Absolutely gorgeous. And a little cafe. It looks like a little sweet donut shop cafe. Absolutely love it. Very, very pretty. And wow, this is a really nice shore. I absolutely love the shore here. Such a nice, nice area that they have with the custom pass that they used as well. And I love this neighborhood. And I like how they put each of the villagers' homes on, on, a, on a tier, almost. And I think it's really, really good. Well done with the terraforming. The terraforming is really good with, with this uh, island. Ooh. Probably a reference that I don't know, um, but I do like how a lot of their villagers are deer, so it does relate to her island. It's really cute. I like it. Very nice, and I love this pier and I love this thing here um, don't know what it's called but I like it when people put that on their pier Ooh. and these little polar bear ice figures so cool This is crazy, whoa. It's like a tropical ice <laughs> um, area. Wait guys, look. Okay, I'm cheesy, but I think that's kind of funny. <laughs> it's like a dance move, right? Ooh, I love the deep pinks and purples that they have here. Oh my gosh, this is like a like a little paradise, like an ice tropical paradise. We made it to the medieval area. 
And here it is. Wait, no. Can I not get through? <laughs> Wait, hold on guys. Hold on. We can do this. Okay, we made it to the medieval area. And this is um, really nice. Look at that. Whoa. That is crazy. I'm so impressed. Um, nothing I have ever seen before. The columns to the left and right, they look like buildings. I know they're not, but they just did such an incredible job. This is the most grand entrance I have ever seen to a museum, right? Oh my gosh. Look at that. They did such a good job. Again, absolutely incredible job. Very pretty, so intricate and well done. And I'm getting like medieval Italian vibes and I absolutely love it. Absolutely love it. They did such an incredible, incredible job. I'm actually kind of speechless, not gonna lie. Um, don't know what else to say other than that that was a really, really cool area. And I believe this is where Red comes to sell you uh, some fake art. <laughs> um, but no, all jokes aside, very, very pretty. I love it. A very simple idea with the barrels on the shore. And I actually like how they put a little cafe, a little restaurant, um, right before you head on over there. Um, and it's giving me a little bit of a pirate, pirate theme, pirate kind of vibe with the barrels everywhere and things like that and the entrance is very cute i like the autumnal archway oh my gosh this is such a cute furniture piece and this huge bear whoa this is like a mushroom core type of vibe going on absolutely love it. I like how they didn't stick to one theme either. You know, and that kind of makes it exciting for the, the viewers or the visitors of, of your island as well. Okay. And we are back at the island. So absolutely gorgeous. I highly recommend going to this dream address. Um, it is an island to see for sure. So that is it for this video, guys. Um, if you haven't already, if you're new, please hit that subscribe button and turn on your post notifications to let you know when I upload. And with that all being said, I will see you guys again with a next video or a live stream. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.